Good morning guys and welcome to another day in the life of Pi, this time coming at you from Ubud. Uh, unfortunately we cocked up a little bit, we only booked this place for one night uh, and it's a gorgeous little place, the Kalesh Homestay, one of the best uh, showers I've had in a while. And we tried to extend our stay this morning because we couldn't, couldn't find them last night. Uh, unfortunately we can't extend the stay because they're fully booked. Uh, so we're going to have to move hotels yet again. This is becoming quite a theme, moving hotels every other day or so. Uh, the next place we go, we're going to try and stay for a couple of days because we're in Ubud, Ubud for maybe two or three days at least. So uh, going to try and stay at the next place for a few days. Uh, my hair is going wild, so I could probably do the haircut at some point in the next couple of days. Uh, I think today we are going to go and explore some Ubud, uh, try and find some of the rice terraces, um, check out the monkey forest. Uh, there's loads of things to do around Ubud, so uh, we've managed to sort out a scooter for 55,000 rupees, which is pretty cheap. So we're going to jump on the scooter once we've moved hotel uh, and then start exploring uh, Ubud in more detail. So uh, let's go and find a hotel and uh, then get this down the go. We just moved to our second hotel room. Uh, luckily, the owners of Kailesh, their younger brother, has just opened a brand new homestay um, and they said, oh, they can cut you a deal and do it for the same price that they were doing it in town. So we're a little bit out of Ubud, about a kilometre outside the centre of town. Uh, but we're staying right next to a river and we have got this gorgeous room. So there's a nice big double bedroom, the AC is really really good and then we've got a brand new bathroom with a bathtub. So I'm going to celebrate by having a bath. Uh, even out the window just down there is a small river. Um, so it's beautiful peaceful surroundings and uh, we've got it for the same price as we had last night, so 200,000 rupees, which is about $12, which is pretty cheap. Um, so we've just come down here on the bike, uh, just gonna unpack some stuff, and then we're gonna start exploring the area, uh, and go out into Ubud and start seeing some of the countryside. Uh, but this is a beautiful little homestay, Badding homestay, uh, and it's really, really pretty. Just stopped at a little warung on the way to the monkey sanctuary. Uh, we're getting cooked up now. some nice Balinese food right now. Uh, then we're going to go to the monkey place, uh, check out the monkey temple, uh, and then see what else we get up to today. Um, but I'll show you lunch, show you a bit of the drive, and then uh, let's go see some monkeys. Guys, we've got some special uh, Balinese fried rice with uh, smoked chicken. And I said I'd film it before I started eating, but it got here and it looks so amazing, so I started eating straight away. The smoked chicken is absolutely delicious. And we've got a little bit of sambal to go with it, and Fab's got her little tofu fried rice as well. Arrived at the Monkey Forest, paid the 50,000 rupee entrance fee, which is about £2.50 or $3. dollars uh, no, no, we're now going to walk through the forest, so let's go and check it out. So we are in the middle of the monkey forest and we're literally surrounded by monkeys. Um, there's a little baby one just on over my shoulder there and they're all running around us and they're really quite cute. Uh, these monkeys aren't as much of a pest as most monkeys. Um, going to explore the forest some more. This guy's looking a little bit menacing at me. Uh, but let's go and check out some more monkeys.
on a sugar high for days mate up in the monkey jungle um, really pretty cool uh, nice to walk around and see all the monkeys um, as you can guess because I've been in Asia for so long I've been to a lot of places with a lot more monkeys than this but the monkey jungle itself is really cool for three pound you can walk around there's temples uh, it's a really cool like forest reserve area for the monkeys to all hang out in the baby monkeys were especially cute and they were nice to see I'm not really sure what we're doing now um, I think tomorrow we're probably going to have a full day out at the rice terraces and some waterfalls and temples and things like that but um, today's a bit more of a lazy day um, so I think we'll probably explore a bit more around Ubud, uh, take the bike for a little drive and see what we see. So we came back to the hotel after the monkey forest, uh, I had some editing to do and we just chilled out in a really nice hotel room. It's such a nice room uh, and it's got a bath, which is a real bonus. So I'm gonna treat myself to a bath at some point over the next couple of days. Uh, we were just about to go out into Ubud Center, but it's just started absolutely hammering it down with rain. Uh, so we're gonna sit it out and wait for the rain to stop. Then we're gonna go into Ubud Center, grab some dinner, have a wander around, maybe go to the art market as well. Uh, so we're gonna check out some stuff in the center of Ubud. <laughs> Guys, just coming to the centre of Wilbur, having a little wander around, uh, as per usual. Uh, Fab's found herself a jewellery shop, and uh, she started shopping. So, uh, I'm standing out on the street, a really beautiful jewellery shop actually, Blink by Kapil Laut. Um, really beautiful jewellery, uh, not that expensive either. Hello! Um, and we are just going to have a wander around Ubud Town Centre. I'll film some of the town centre for you guys and go for some dinner. Guys, so that's it for tonight. It's been a uh, really cool day exploring the monkey forest, uh, seeing the monkeys playing around and opening bananas and generally having a good time. The little baby monkeys were so cute as well. Uh, but that's it for today. Um, remember to give the video a thumbs up if you like it, hit that subscribe button, share it on all the social medias, and until tomorrow guys, peace out. <laughs>